welcome back. In today's lesson on scientific notation, you'll be able to define it, understand when it is important to use it, show how to multiply and divide it by hand, and be able to explain how the E key on the calculator is used for scientific notation. What is the mass of the Earth in kilograms without using scientific notation? In science, we often use numbers that are very large or very small. There has got to be an easier way to write this than writing out five, nine, seven, two, zero, 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 zero kilograms. Or what about Avogadro's number? In chemistry, it's used to define the quantity of something. And that's a, a large number. In science, we use scientific notation to write large numbers or very small numbers um, to simplify them. So to write scientific notation, you have a value called the coefficient, which is multiplied by a power of 10. Um, so a power of 10 looks like this, 10 to a power, 10 to the power of zero is one. 10 to the power of one is 10, or one with one zero at the end. So this, this exponent here will also tell you the number of zeros that follow the one. So 10 to the second power is 10 times 10, or 100, and 10 to the third power is, you guessed it, 10 times 10 times 10, or 1,000, and so on and so forth. So the speed of light through space is 300 million meters per second. To write this in scientific notation so that you don't have to write all of these zeros, you're going to take the non-zero digit 3, that is called the coefficient, and you're going to multiply that by a power of 10. So what is this power here going to be? That's going to be the number of zeros that follow the 3. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. So 3 times 10 to the 8th meters per second is the speed of light, a photon, through space. Earth and Neptune are 4.6 trillion meters apart. Put your decimal after the first non-zero number to write this in scientific notation. You're going to carry down the 4.6, and you're going to determine how many decimal places you need to move. That's going to tell you your power of 10. So 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12. I would need to multiply 4.6 by 10 to the 12th power in order to get 4.6 trillion. So you can see how scientific notation is useful because it takes very large numbers and writes them in a simple fashion. Okay, so 10 to the 12th is the same thing as saying I'm going to multiply times 1 trillion. Obviously, you don't want to write all that out, so we say times 10 to the 12th. Very small numbers can also be converted to scientific notation. An E. coli bacterium is 0. 0.000021 meters long. Again, put your decimal after the first non-zero number and write that 2.1 times 10 to what power? Now in this case, our decimal is going in the other direction. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. So I'm going to write my exponent with a negative sign, 10 to the negative 6. Now this is the same as saying I'm going to take 2.1 and I'm going to divide it by 10 six times. Or times one-tenth six times. <clears throat> or 2.1 times 0 0.000 zero, zero, one. So both of these are the same. Let's apply. 
If lined up end to end, how many E. coli bacteria would fit in the distance between Earth and Neptune? What would you do mathematically to solve this problem? Would you add, subtract, multiply, or divide? That's right, you would divide. Take this value divided by that value. 4.6 times 10 to the 12th meters divided by 2.1 times 10 to the negative 6th meters. This is the same as saying 4.6 divided by 2.1 times 10 to the I'm going to put a bracket here, 12 minus negative 6. So in your calculator, 4.6 divided by 2.1 gives me 2.19. So I'll use two significant figures here. That's 2.2 times 10 to the... 12 minus negative 6 gives me 18. 2.2 times 10 to the 18th power. So here are your rules for scientific notation. Number one, in scientific notation, the decimal goes after the first non-zero digit. That is going to be called the coefficient. Number two, the decimal number is multiplied by a power of 10. Three, the power of 10 is positive if the value is greater than 1, and it is negative if the value is less than 1. And number four, the power of 10 is the same as the number of places the decimal will be moved to get to the long form of the value. I'll do a few examples with you. In your science notebook, go ahead and label this class examples converting scientific notation. And make sure you list these A, B, C, D, etc. in your notebook. All right, remember the rule, put the decimal after the first non-zero number. So this is 9.5. These are the only two significant values, sorry, significant digits. These are the only two significant digits, so you don't write any zeros after that five. Multiply by 10 to the one, two, three, four. 10 to the fourth. Okay, B. Put your decimal after the first non-zero number. One, two, three, four. And count until you get to where the decimal is supposed to be. So 9.5. Zero, 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 zero times 10 to the fourth. So why do I have to include all of these zeros here? Because they are significant in this value. There are one, two, three, four, five, six significant figures. So in your scientific notation, you also have to have one, two, three, four, five, six significant figures. All right, example C. One, two, three. 9.5 times 10 to the negative 3. So if you have a value less than 1, you're going to have a negative exponent. D, this is also less than 1, so you have a negative exponent. 9.5 what? 0, all of these are significant, times 10 to the negative 3. Next, 95.0 times 10 to the negative 1. This one is not in the correct form. Do you know why? That decimal needs to go after the first non-digit number. So I'll show you an easy way to look at this. You can write the number in long form first. So 10 to the negative 1 power means my decimal goes in this direction. So my long form of the number is 9.50. That is your answer here. I don't have to change anything. <clears throat> B. 
But let's look at F. 9,500 times 10 to the negative 3. 1, 2, 3. 9.5 and that's my answer. Since the decimal is already after the first digit, I don't have to multiply by 10 to a power. You could say times 10 to the 0, but you're never going to see that notation because 10 to the 0 is equal to 1. In this one, 950 Point zero times 10 to the fourth. One, two, three, four. Fill in those empty spaces with zeros. And place your decimal at the end. So this is the value in long form. Now I'm going to put it in the correct form of scientific notation. So let me convert this. Put your decimal after the first non zero number. 9.500. I'm only going to keep the digits that are significant for my coefficient. Coefficient. Okay, now I need to multiply by 10 to the what? If I had my decimal here, it would be 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 10 to the 6. So this is my answer for G. Now another way to look at G is if it's 950 times 10 to the fourth and I need to move my decimal back two places, I'm just going to count those in as um, along with the four. So two plus those four give me six. Okay, now let's write these in decimal form. 9.50 times 10 to the fourth. One, two, three, four. You're moving your decimal four places to the right, or in other words, multiplying by 10,000, and fill in the missing spaces with zeros. On I, 0 0.0095 times 10 to the 6, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. If the coefficient is positive, move decimal to the right. 9.50. Okay, on J, the exponent is negative, so you're going to move that decimal to the left. Negative, move decimal to left. Okay, so we have point zero 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 nine five. All right, for K, negative, move to the left, fill in missing zeros, so 0 0.09500. Zero, zero. These are all significant figures, so you have to keep them in your answer. All right, L, 1, 2, point zero nine five zero. These are your significant digits. Keep them in your answer. And you don't have to put boxes around them. I just wanted to show you. All right, M. One, two, three, so point zero zero nine five. N. One, two, three, four. Nine five zero zero one two three four more zeros. Okay, which problems in H through N above show equivalent values? Nineteen 
95,000, 9,500, 0 0.0095, 0 0.095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0 0.0095, 0
that gives me 7.374. Now you can carry over the times 10 to the second meters. Next, you're going to look at your significant figures. So here, where both of my units are the same and my exponents on my powers of 10 are the same, I am going to look at the first value and notice that it is measured out to the tens hundredths place. And the second value is measured to the thousandth place. So my answer should round to the hundredths place or the least precise decimal place. So my answer is going to be 7.37 times 10 to the second. It seems long and drawn out now, but after you do this a few times, it becomes second nature to go ahead and check your units first and your exponents. Also, you can use a calculator to check your answer. Fun example R. I'm checking to see my units are the same. They are. Great. Now I need to make my exponents the same. What's easier to do is see which one has the larger exponent. This just makes it easier for me to add and subtract two values in scientific notation. So the first value, this one here, has the larger exponent. That means I'm going to take the second value and convert it so that it matches and it also has a times 10 to the 18th. So 3.60 times 10 to the 17th is going to be, what is my new coefficient going to be when I multiply by 10 to the 18th? If right now I'm multiplying by 10 to the 17th, I'm going 17 decimal places that way. So I need to back it up one, back that decimal up one, so that I'm going 18 places to the right. So this is my new value that I can now easily add by hand by lining up the decimal. When I add 2.840 plus 0 0.360, I get 3.2. And then carry down your times 10 to the 18th. That just means there are 18 um, decimal places following that decimal. All right, that's the end of how to write in scientific notation. These are the good tutoring websites that I've found to help you with topic one. All right, guys, have a great day. Bye.